I am up here at King with Silas Red, and Silas was just honored as one of the selections for the U.S. Army All-American Bowl. Silas, what does this mean to you? It means so much just you know, to be able to, to play in this game where the caliber of athletes who played before me include you know, Reggie Bush and Vince Young. It's, it's, it's an incredible honor. I'm really blessed. What did you do? I know everybody's talked about all the hard work that you've had to do to get here. Why don't you tell me a little bit about that? You know, since I was young, my father had me, you know, doing push-ups at a young age. I would say like six or seven, you know, doing push-ups before I got in the bath or shower. You know, that really stuck with me till now. And I've been, for the past year, I've been training with Blue Streak. And they've really helped me and, you know, my, my school workout. So just, just non nonstop hard, hard work all, all throughout the year has really paid off. I just talked to your uh, coach up here, I talked to Danny, and he told me that uh, you were, he was sent up to watch you play in Pop Warner about 11 years ago, and right away he could tell uh, you were special even back then. That's something, uh, did, you, did you feel early on that you could be a good football player? I mean, I knew, you know, every kid who plays football, you know, dreams of going to the NFL, but I never knew that my ability was, you know, would take me this far, and you know, I'm really proud of myself. Uh, unlike yesterday with Kyrie, we already knew you were going to Penn State for a while. What made you decide on Penn State? Well, you know, I've been wanting to go there since, since I was a kid. And once, you know, they gave me the, the scholarship offer, it was, it was really game over after that. I mean, I love everything about the school, especially, you know, they give the opportunity for me to, to, to have a great education first and foremost, and then get it done on the football field as well. I mean, it's, it's a win-win situation. You and Kyrie have been friends for a long time. What does it mean for you to have Kyrie coming with you to Penn State? It means a lot. It means a lot. We'll, you know, we'll go through everything together, adversities, and be in a classroom together, and be in a dorm together, be on the field together, and you know, we're really creating a brotherhood. I understand you guys are talking about rooming together. If, if we can, uh, we really would like to set that up. We're not sure if we can pick or if they pick, but if we can, we'll definitely room together. Now, presumably you guys will be practicing against each other. Have you guys ever played against each other before? No, we've never played against each other, so I'm excited for that. I can't wait for that. He's going to be trying to stop you in practice. Is he going to be able to do that? I'm going to give him a hard time. <laughs> he might catch me one or two times, but I'm, trust me, it's going, to be, it's going to be tough. Why don't we talk a little bit, too, about the King season. You guys are off to a great start. You're coming off a big win this past weekend. Talk a little bit about the season uh, the team's been having. Well, you know, we're just hungry. After we lost the... Uh, the New England Championship game last last year, last November. We've been really hungry and really itching to get back to that game. So we're, we're on a mission. Think you guys can do it this year? I think we got it this year. I'm not going to speak too soon, but we're going to work hard. I think it says a lot. Coach also just told me you're winning touchdown this past week inside the 50-yard line with a little bit less than a minute to go. Normally in that situation, you're going to pass the ball, but uh, Coach said because he had somebody of your talent, he didn't mind uh, calling a run and play there. That's uh, it's a lot of respect for your ability. Right, and I thank him for that. I thank him trusting me you know, my, for my ability to, you know, to play this game. And we all, you know, players, playmakers strive in times of, you know, when they feel pressure. And so, you know, that was, that's all that was, man. I'm a playmaker, so they gave me the ball and I made a play. The one thing I'm really struck by today, everybody I've spoken to up here just talks about how popular you are, how respectful you are. Uh, I know you have a really, really close relationship with your parents, and uh, I think it's evidence uh, by the way you act that they've had a lot of impact in your life. So, um, you know, just from instilling that in me from a young age, just to be respectful, carry yourself with a certain manner. And, you know, never be out of line. And that's where I take to, I'll take to the grave with me. Well, I think the only place you're out of line is on a football field when other people are trying to stop you. So, <laughs> Silas, congratulations. I know everybody here is real excited uh, you, about your accomplishment, and we wish you the best of luck this season and beyond. Thank you. Thank you so much.